Hi, this is Chris, and one of the most commonly asked questions is, what is a yard of rock? Well, a yard of rock is actually one cubic yard of rock. And a cubic yard is measured in retail work by the bucket load. Some rock yards have a half yard bucket on their machines. Some have a bucket slightly larger than that. They like to brag, oh, I've got a 5 8 yard bucket. Okay. So exactly how do you account for measuring that after you get several scoops, as they call it? Well, we just keep it simple. This machine has a one yard bucket on it. And any machine that has a one yard or half yard bucket on it, when it's scooped, the rock should be level from front to back. You can see that this has got slightly more than a yard on it because it's definitely not level front to back. But if you're getting loaded up at the rock yard, you certainly don't want it to be less than level. Otherwise, you're not getting your half yard, your half skip, or whatever they want to call it. Our materials are typically delivered when they're bought in small amounts in super sacks. And these super sacks are loaded to one cubic yard or one ton. Sometimes they're loaded to 3,000 pounds. It just depends upon the value of the rock and how it's being transported. If we're delivering it, it's usually one yard or 3,000 pounds because the bags cost money and if we can save a bag or half a bag then that's an extra eight to twelve dollars we save. It also depends upon the value of the rock. This is California gold rock. Yeah, I mean expensive by the time it gets to you but not nearly as expensive as Alabama jelly beans or coral sea, parchment, salmon bay, all the other names they have. So the value of the rock often dictates whether it's going to be sold by the yard or by the pound or ton. Since this material is very expensive comparatively, it's going to be weighed and it's going to be sold uh, by the pound or the ton. Yeah, I can afford to let go a little extra California gold to make the super sack look nice and impressive and uh, make sure someone gets their money's worth. So I don't mind taking this little bit of rock and putting it in a super sack. But essentially, when you buy rock at a rock yard, you're paying for it by the yard. They'll call it a skip, a scoop, whatever it is, you want to make sure from front to back, when they're loading it, that you're getting your money's worth. And when you're buying several of these units, the Mickey Mouse games of, oh, I've got 5 eighths or 5 sixteenths or 7 eighths or whatever. You know what? It, all that matters is that it adds up to the amount you need. And nobody's giving away any significant rock for free. So the promo, our bucket is 5 eighths, so you get an extra eighth rock free. Come on. What a lie. I mean, really? You're just giving away free rock that like you paid by the ton to have trucked and, and quarry. Not really. Just hustling stupid talk on people. So that's what a yard is. A full one yard bucket of rock.